2-2 pitch, lifted in the air, up the right field line, long run for Cameron Frost, gonna make a dive into foul territory, and he's there to make the catch. And so far, Chap, one out of seven this weekend, and he steers that one through the hole on the right-hand side, and gotten here to Washington State, pitch on the way to P.J., ground ball, and that one is a C-Nye single, and P.J. Jones with the base hit, and runners at first and second. The 2-2 pitch, a swing on this. Loker will strike out. That'll be the third strikeout for Ryan Walker. And his 3-2 offer on the way. Swing and a miss on a 92 mile an hour fastball. And that will take care of Branton. That will also retire the side here in the fourth inning. Top half of the sixth, runners at first and third. Middle of the infield at double play depth that ends up off of the Hamilton and two Sagdal, and it's gonna be a one, six, three double play. Fly ball off the bat of Donlin into the gap in left center field. Back goes the center fielder. It's gonna get over the glove of Klein. Donlin into second base with a double. And the 3-1 offer on the way is a fly ball to right field. Over will be the right fielder, and it's off the glove of Loker. That's going to drop in, and the Cougars catch a break. Here comes the 0-1 pitch. There's a fly ball, somewhat shallow right center field. On comes Loker, on comes the center fielder. Neither can get to it. It's going to be an RBI single for Shane Matheny. Pitch to P.J., ground ball through on the left-hand side. One run is scored. Here comes Matheny, and he is out, trying to score the winning run. Got through the seventh, now into the eighth. He's already worked two. Fly ball hit well to right center field. Chapman, though, has a track, and right on the warning track, he is there to make the catch. 11 innings for the Cougars today. The 2-1 offer on the way. Ground ball sharply hit. Glove by Sagdahl. Spins on his pants and fires over to first. What a play by Ian Sagdahl. The seniors. There's the 1-1 pitch on the way. And that's going to be past the first baseman and up the right field line. Chapman's going to take the turn and is on his way into second. And he is in with a leadoff double. And the 0-1 offer on the way is a bunt up the third baseline. There will be just the one play at first base, and the senior gets the job done. And of course, with the back-to-back -back intentional walks, we mentioned no wiggle room here for Kramer. Every base already has somebody on it. Chapman at third, Sagdahl at second, Fredrickson at first. And a 1-0 pitch to Cooper Elliott on the way. Fly ball, right field, will it be enough? Over goes Loker, he's near the line, makes the catch. Here comes Chapman, the throw to the plate. It's gonna be late, and the Cougars are gonna win. A sacrifice fly and an RBI for Cooper Elliott, and they're gonna mob him up the first baseline, and the Cougars will finish 2015 with a victory on a sacrifice fly from Cooper Elliott. They win a game, they send the seniors off on a winning note, and they secure a winning record in 2015.